Yeah. 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 These boys and girls, what you learn yeah. as I do my yeah. 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 These boys and girls, what you learn as I do my Okay, you guys. So it is 3:30 in the morning, and I'm gonna do my braids because we're going to Jamaica on Sunday, and. So for this style, I did use six packs of braiding hair and one and a half packs of the curly hair. I look, you can find this at your local beauty supply store and I use Beauty Exchange. So first you want to use heat protectant when you blow drying your hair because you need to make sure your roots are not still fuzzy or anything like that. You have to make sure they is like able to just run your fingers through it. So I'm like very much so tender headed. So we're going to speed this process up. You guys know, like I said, just make sure you blow dry your hair thoroughly, like, to where your fingers is not hitting no naps, baby. Like, the roots to the tips, no naps. I gotta hit the beat. I gotta hit the beat, beat. I gotta hit the beat. I gotta hit the beat, beat. I gotta hit the beat. I gotta hit the beat, beat. I gotta hit the beat. I gotta hit the beat, beat. I have blow dry the hair. Now we're gonna part it. What I like to use is shiny tan. So it is kind of hard to part your hair by yourself if you <laughs> clearly can see this here. But so I, I mean, it took me a little. It took me about an hour, you guys, to part my whole head. Like lower. So. You know, you have to go through with the rat tail comb. Make sure those parts are neat as possible. I mean, of course, because you're doing it by yourself, it is going to be a little bit more trickier. But like I said, that shiny gem will help you clean them up. Okay? I gotta hit the beat. I gotta hit the beat, beat. I gotta hit the beat. I gotta hit the beat, beat. I gotta hit the beat. I gotta hit the beat, beat. I gotta hit the beat. I gotta hit the beat, beat. Okay, so now we have finished the back. And for the front, I mean, it's a little bit easier. You know, you still gotta get that crown. Go all the way around your head to have both sides even out. You know what I'm saying? I gotta hit the beat. I gotta hit the beat, beat. I gotta hit the beat. So, I have a big forehead. So, I don't really like doing a middle part with it. So, here I go. I am doing it to where I can flip it to left or right. And, you know, we're going to part it in three sections. Because, <laughs> you know what I'm saying? But they always say the pretty girls got the biggest foreheads. Okay. <laughs> so, mm, period. I gotta hit the beat. I gotta hit the beat, beat. I gotta hit the beat. So now that all the rows have been parted, we're going to section them off. You know, the back of the head is ridiculous, girl. It's ridiculous. <laughs> but whatever, you know, it's still going to be cute, period. Because what is you saying? It's Dion who doing it, okay? So you're going to take three parts. You know how you start a regular braid. These are knotless. So when it comes with knotless, you're going to start off your braid just a little bit. Little bit. Then you're going to add the extra hair. So, so So now that we have added the curly piece, we can go ahead and just finish the braid. 
And honestly, you guys, if you go braid, <laughs> make it a braid. Do you hear me? Don't have it to your ear. <laughs> or maybe it's just me, but like if I get braids, I want my braids to be braiding, okay? It got to go down to the kneecaps. Like, what is you saying? Long hair, don't care. Period. Like, if you go get extensions, get extensions. Quit playing with them. Quit playing with them. You'll see. <laughs> and if you notice, I'm putting the hair in my mouth because once it gets longer, it's harder to braid and reach down. So that pull will have that tension to allow you to keep a, like, I'm going to say a neat braid. Because you don't want them thick clunks bulking up. Like, no. Make sure your braid is neat through and through. Okay? I gotta hit the beat. I gotta hit the beat, beat. I gotta hit the beat. I gotta hit the beat, beat. I gotta hit the beat. I gotta hit the beat, beat. I gotta hit the beat. I gotta hit the beat, beat. I gotta hit the beat. I gotta hit the beat, beat. I gotta hit the beat. I gotta hit the beat, beat. I gotta hit the beat. I gotta hit the beat, beat. I gotta hit the beat. I gotta hit the beat, beat. I gotta hit the beat. I gotta hit the beat, beat. I gotta hit the beat. I gotta hit the beat, beat. Yes. Okay, I can't lie feeling myself yes <laughs> period so this is like my favorite edge control it is black owned and it's no alcohol so your edges will not be leaving you sis make sure y'all go buy it you can find this at your local beauty supply store yes ma'am i love it i usually like to do little swivels and stuff like extra creative edges but right now i'm just trying to speed through this because i've been doing this for seven hours y'all Yes, I took me an hour lunch break, but you know what I'm saying. Now we're about to go under the dryer. So we got to use mousse. You know, make sure everything is neat and clean. And here we are. Yeah, time to heat up the hair. And we are filling it. Yes, ma'am. <laughs> yes, ma'am. As I said, them braids is braiding. Do you hear me? Long. Yes. <laughs> Thank you for watching. Don't forget to like, comment, subscribe.